Here are some wicked mocks Atiku Abubakar over Obasanjo's endorsement of Peter Obi of the Labour Party. Hello everyone, welcome to Newsport TV, compliments of the season. Governor Yesom Wike has mocked Asiku Abubakar over former President Lucia Gumabasson just endorsement of Labour's party Peter Obi. Atiku was vice president during the Obasson administration between 1999 to 2007. But on Sunday, the former Nigerian president recommended Obi for the country's number one seat next year. A move, the River State Governor said, means there is something fundamentally wrong. I was praying that Obas Onjo should not say anything. When I saw the letter last night, I was touched. If your principal cannot recommend you, then there is something fundamentally wrong. Wike said on Monday at the flag off of the construction of Akbabo Odido Road in Emohua and Ohuada West local government areas. After all, you people went to see your principal to lobby him to recommend you. It took your principal a long time before he now wrote a letter to all Nigerians saying, Look, I am not too comfortable with Atiku. I am not bothered about other people, but this one, Obasanjo, worked with you and he knows why he took that decision. So let's take some of the comments. A commenter said, I will never be a part of another Buari. I sense another suffering if Peter Obi wins. Remember how Nigerians wanted change in 2015? Atiku is not a saint and I'm okay with Atiku. Another person said, we are just praying for the best. May God guide us to choose for a better one. Someone else said, I pray Nigeria will not still regret for their decision of choosing Obi. Another said, OBJ has made his choice known. So, Governor Wike, what are you waiting for? Let us know openly where you belong. Somebody said, I think Wike is Labour Party's joker. This country must work for its citizens and we are voting for Peter Obi. The signs are glaring. Somebody else said, but Amechi is Wike's principal too. And he didn't like Wike too. Wike should go already and stop ranting every time. Another said, there will be apathy in the next general election. Lots won't vote and those that will vote will only vote Obi. Um, somebody else said there's only one party with competence and true leadership and that is Labour Party. All other parties are criminalized with people who just want to steal more from Nigerians. If Una like, make Una let them use 5k by Una future. Now Una go cry last last. Everyone vote Peter Obi for your own secured future in Nigeria and as a Nigerian. Um, somebody else said Peter Obi for president, I beg no time. Another person said, Obasanjo is a featherweight politician. Wiki, you were here in 2019 when Obasanjo said Atiku was the best for Nigeria. So let OBJ support whoever. It only got that in thrones. Another said, Obasanjo could endorse Peter Obi with his full chest. What about Governor Wiki? He does not have the balls to do the same thing. All he does is talk and make a fool of himself. Another said, you mean the same about Sanjo that endorsed Atiku in 2019? Wiki, please have sense now. It's okay if you don't support Atiku. Besides, OBJ don't even have much political influence in these regards. Another person said, it's the usual politics. The winner of 2003 election will not and cannot perform magic to fix this country. Except the masses decide to fix their various communities. I pity Nigerians putting their hopes on these politicians. Peter Obi is not a magician and may not be able to fix our problems easily. Another person said, Wiki, but you also fell out with your best friend, Amechi. Politics is all about interest for now. Another says, these politicians are unpredictable. I don't think Obasanjo is speaking from his heart. Over the years, the man has been attacking, pardoning and supporting Atiko. Yes, the former vice president, as up to date, offers utters a word against the former president. So these are some of the comments that are still this. Everybody knows Wiki has been talking, talking, and talking, especially since the time of the primary, even before the primary, till now. And the question people are asking is, where do you belong? Okay, um, ex-president Obasanjo has taken a side. 
then which side are you on are you also going to take a side for example a few hours ago governor samuel autumn of benue state came out with his full chest to say that among the three presidential candidates he thinks and believes that peter obi is the right man for the job and he'll be campaigning for him despite the fact that he autumn is a pdp member and part of the g5 so people are now asking governor wk as part of the g5 what's your plan who are you voting for who are you campaigning for who do you think is the right man for the job who is your choice but he's here to speak like they said he's dealing dialing and trying to waste chances so as not to remain irrelevant but eventually the candidate he picks eventually does not win a lot of things happen like this in politics that sometimes some politicians over calculate and if they do make a mistake in their choice that could mean the end of their political career we've seen that happen over and over and over again we case case might be a different issue what's your opinion on this please drop your comments in the comment section below thank you so much for watching and for our new subscribers Thank you, thank you, thank you for joining us. We hope you stay. Have a lovely day. Stay safe out there. God bless Nigeria and bye for now.